What is going on, everyone? Uh, Jay and Samara back with Trailer Cash Academy. And today we're going to be speaking with one of our rock star students, Jasmine Means. She's actually here in the Phoenix market. Um, she's been doing some great things. She made $6,000 profit on her first deal. She's got a few other deals she's working on in the pipeline. Uh, multiple appointments they're going on. Just really, really busy um, <laughs> doing some out. crazy things with mobile homes. And we wanted to uh, just talk about that first deal in hopes that it'll help some of you all get started or get some more clarity in this niche. So first and foremost, Jasmine, uh, we want to know what was life like uh, for you before joining Trailer Cash Academy? Oh, man. Um, first of all, thanks for having me, guys. I really do appreciate no, for it. Sure. No problem. But uh, life before was interesting. I, I first got into real estate um, doing traditional like stick build homes. And that was a process, uh, learning about wholesaling, going out and putting in footwork and nothing coming back. Um, I know we've talked about it, but put out like 2,000 door hangers and not one call whatsoever. So that was a little, uh, it was a little crushing realizing that. But yeah, that was what I was into is real estate going through that. And Phoenix is kind of saturated um, mm -hmm. with, with wholesaling. So, but getting into Trailer Cash Academy has is, is really been an eye opener for sure. Awesome. I love yeah. to hear that. Love to hear that. So what was, I know you guys were trying to navigate the real estate market, but what was your biggest problem before uh, joining Trader Cash Academy? The biggest problem that we had was really just getting deals done with other real estate ventures as far as like single family homes, because there were so many people like doing the same thing. Everyone had a sign. I mean, I don't know if you guys have seen the We Buy Houses sign, but they're pretty much everywhere. So, I mean, it's, it was trying to figure out how to set ourselves apart from everybody else to, to get into the door to even get walkthroughs and even make an offer. That was the, the biggest thing that we had issues with. What were some of the things you guys did to help you with real estate? Uh, I know you guys mentioned that you did some courses, you tried a different a couple of different strategies within real estate. Can you go inside that a little bit? Yeah. So we, uh, we started out wholesaling just everything under the sun, looking under foreclosures, pre-foreclosures. Pre um, we did probate for a little bit as well, just trying to see what worked. And I mean, I'm, people do it, it works, but yeah. it's just, it's, it's a grind for sure. Yeah. And it's yeah. trying to turn over and make back money that you spent in like Google programs and trying to, it's, it's crazy, but that's, that's what we were just trying to find as much as possible. So yeah, we did probate. Um, pre foreclosure foreclosures um, we even tried to go like to auctions and stuff it was just insane it really was crazy out there so yeah, you guys sounded <laughs> like us when we I just started out say that. <laughs> <laughs> any and every you know real estate event we were buying the programs you know getting with mentors just trying to figure out our space within real estate because there's so many different different avenues to get started in or you can mm -hmm. choose to get started in so after you guys took action, you bought the course, what were your initial results within, within your 30 days? Uh, zero deals. That was the, uh, <laughs> that was the result from the uh, traditional stick build homes. I mean, we, what, we what, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, no, I was going to say, like, we were calling realtors, trying to get deals done. And it was just like, oh, yeah, I'll just add you to the list of other wholesalers that I work with. I'm like, oh, man, okay. <laughs> great like i'm probably not gonna hear from this person you know so it was just trying to get that that follow-up in and like following up with them but they're like oh no i already have a person that i go to so yeah. i'm sorry you know but yeah so zero deals zero deals <laughs> sounds sounds so much similar to us like we went through that whole rat race all of that the competition the saturation the yeah. like being lost in so many different avenues, but let's get into the juicy stuff. So um, what results did you receive after joining Trailer Cash Academy? Trailer Cash Academy. Okay, now that's a different story. <laughs> that was 30 days in closing our first deal, which is insane because, okay, so we started May 20th. We signed up, went through the, through the course, watching videos. It's, I think June 11th we were putting everything out and then we started to get calls in and it was insane. So we got a call in from someone that was getting evicted. We were like, all right, let's see what happens with this. Go to the appointment, see the home, actually get it to where the person's like accepting our offer. And we're like, all right, cool. Don't know what to do with this, but it works. 
and yeah, 30 days later, exactly, July 11th, we, we closed our first deal. As you mentioned, 6,000 profit. Yeah, not expecting it whatsoever. Because I mean, you know, when you when you get into this, you're like, okay, results will happen, you know, and everybody's pitching like the, oh yeah, get it done, it happens so fast. And then it doesn't, you're like, okay, well, that's just another person mm-hmm. telling stories, you know, but like, you guys definitely stand by your word, for <laughs> sure. So I was, I yeah, we blown away. Blown yeah, away. well, you guys put the work in. You put so much work in. You guys yeah. were dedicated. You are are definitely some of our favorite students so far. We, You guys have been so diligent. You listen. You take instructions well. So you got to give yourself some credit. Because sure. at the end of the day, <laughs> in the work, that was not going to work for you. <laughs> um, I want to know, can you go into the situation with that seller? And then mm-hmm. what, uh, as well as what your buyer needed and how you were able to kind of marry the two and get the deal done? Yeah, so what happened was um, the seller was someone that was getting evicted or they had already been evicted, judgment had been issued, but they were having problems with the park and they're like, you know what, I don't want the park to take the home, I would rather sell it to you guys. So we're like, okay, let's see what we can do, we get some details about the home, and it fit what we were looking for, it was an 82, I believe, uh, two by two double wide, um, and a, a 55 plus community, so we're like, okay, that works, it's cool. You know, we're thinking it's going to be beat up, like run down. We go check it out and it's in great shape. And we're like, oh my gosh, I think this may be it, guy. Like, I think this may be a deal. And we're like, okay, calm down. Like, we don't want to get too excited, get too emotionally involved. So um, we we make an offer tour. We run our numbers, get some comps. And um, we throw out like, okay, you know what? We can pick up the home for for 3,400. And she's like, okay, let's do it. I'm like, wait, you just accepted that? Like, are you sure you didn't accept that? (laughs) <laughs> and she's like yeah let's do it so we get it on the contract um we get the title transferred and uh we ended up getting the home moved so because it was in 55 plus community we thought that would be the best route since we can't stay in that that park being uh, under 55 so uh yeah we ended up finding somebody that was interested in moving the home to uh land that they owned and yeah that's, that's how it happened yeah boom boom you're bringing yeah. value on both sides and you're able to help <laughs> someone that was literally about to lose their home like that's yeah. you know, she was about to receive nothing have a ju- judgment on her record be evicted from the community anyway right. and you guys were able to step in and help her out so that is awesome you guys saw an opportunity yeah. you made it, you made it happen. So, uh, congratulations again on For that sure. first 30 days thank you amazing. thank you um so what surprised you the most after actually purchasing the course and implementing the steps? Like what surprised you the most about Trader Cash Academy in the process? What really um, brought everything home, like this actually works, was doing the test ads on Facebook. That was the biggest thing for for me and my brother as well, um, was seeing the response and how in demand these homes are and just seeing like how expensive Arizona is getting for housing it's it's insane and people really need affordable housing so i was like okay they are on to something you know what i mean like they need <laughs> they're on to something so i'm like let me just follow these guys see where they're going see what it's about and yeah going through the course like seeing all the details that go into it, i'm like man like you guys are really helping people like that's what really really mm-hmm. got me like locked in is how you can actually help somebody get a home and have home ownership and do whatever else they need to do, but like they, they have a pride in their home. Like it's it's insane driving through some of these parks and seeing the things that people do to the home. It yeah. really is. Yeah, they're nice, right? <laughs> like, yeah, they are. The communities are like, wow, like, for, they're so nice. For years, we all just passed them up, didn't even look twice at the mobile home park thinking there was no value in them. Um, mm-hmm. We want to know uh, for anyone that's out there kind of either on the fence about uh, starting their mobile home investing journey or just struggling to get started in real estate, only getting, you know, one or two wholesale deals done in 12 months or 24 months. Um, What advice would you recommend uh, about starting with, you know, Trailer Cash Academy? I would say uh, the biggest thing is, is taking your time and like really understanding what's happening, but not just being stuck in analyzing all the data. It's about taking action and marrying those two points together, you know? So, I, I definitely think that's the biggest thing, at least for me, is learning the information, learning the knowledge, and then applying it out in the field and seeing how what I learned actually works in the real world, you know, because you can only give so many scenarios, but when you actually take the action and get out there and have those 
sellers come back at you with rebuttals and you're like, I don't know what to do now, you know, it's like having that experience and then it's like, okay, now I can tie those two together. And it makes everything make a lot more sense as well, at least for me. I know going back through the videos and rewatching, I'm like, oh, that's what you guys meant, you know, like after <laughs> having that situation happen. So right. that's, that's the biggest thing for me. I love awesome. that feedback. I love the fact that you guys kind of went through the course, you went through all the modules, you got a got an overview of how everything works. You just took that information, you applied it, and you really only reached out to us when it was like an actual deal. And then when we talked, you know, we gave you some pointers. You guys did everything we said and ended up getting the deal done. And now you guys are working on different deals, you know, wholesale opportunities coming your way, multiple appointments, you know, each week getting, you know, called multiple calls per week. How, how does all of this feel? What's, what's going on? <laughs> it's it feels so good but it's still like is this really happening you know just coming from from the real estate side of like stick build and doing the same work and putting in the same effort and nothing happening it's like oh my gosh like I don't know what everybody else is doing maybe I'm just not good at it you know just questioning myself but like coming over to mobile homes and like putting in the same effort and getting an actual like result it's like okay I'm doing something right. You know, like I, I can do this. Like it feels yeah. really, really good. It really does feel good. So it's just repeating that process again. Yeah. Well, you heard it from Jasmine herself. Yeah. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better. Um, we thank you so much for sharing Appreciate your experience, you. your story with us today. Um, so if you guys are interested, please click the link below. We'll set up a time with you. If you're interested in joining Trailer Cash Academy and learning more like Jasmine did, we would love to help. And always, you know, be sure to, uh, subscribe and hit the bell button to be notified of videos we post every week. We got a ton of more value coming for you guys. Thank you so much for being with us, Jasmine, sharing your story. We look forward to you and your brother growing in this field and getting more deals. Yes, yes. Oh, thank so you guys. We appreciate it. Absolutely. Thanks so much, Jasmine. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye.